Good morning. Good morning, Panthers. What's good, Panthers? What's up, Panthers? Make today better than yesterday, Panthers. Good morning, Panthers. Good morning, Panthers. Have a good day. Good morning. How are you doing? How's your morning going? Have a great day, Panthers. Good morning, family. My name is Alex. Hey, Panthers, and I'm Ellie. Today is Friday, March 1st. Today is an A day. Today's win time is B day, block three. Please stand and join me for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please remain standing for the moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The weather for today will be mostly cloudy. The high temperature will be 59 degrees. There is a 35% chance of rain today. The moon phase is a waning gibbous. Happy birthday today to Chloe Schroeder and Nash Dillon. Happy birthday this weekend to James Hennick, Daniel Hennick, Lance Graham, Jack Call, Evan Canada, and Colby Siren. According to National Today, today is National Pig Day. We see pigs in art, costumes, stuffed animals, collectibles, piggy banks, movies, books, and of course, on the, di on the dinner table. Pigs have lived throughout the country on farms and in zoos for many years and even in our homes as pets. It's only fitting to have a day dedicated to these easily recognizable, endearing creatures and learn about how they are part of our culture and history. Library Bingo and Comedy Wildlife are due tomorrow. Here's your reminder to charge your computers each and every night. Here's another reminder, make sure to keep AirPods out of your ears when in the hallway. The concert band will meet after school on Tuesday, March 5th. The ASL club will meet next Wednesday after school, 2.45 to 3.30 in the art room. The beta club will meet March 7th and March 21st this month. The treble chorus will meet next Tuesday after school from 3 to 4. The James A. Bland Scholarship Competition Registration is due today. The SMS yearbook is on sale. The cost is $35 and orders are due April 15th. Here's your reminder that school is closed Monday for a teacher professional day. Enjoy the day off, Panthers. Eighth graders, please turn in some of your baby pictures to Miss Hammer by email or by physical copy. The book fair will close today at 1.30. Thank you for all of your support. Dogman pre-order payments are due to Ms. Hamrick on March 13th. The cost is $14.99. Online payments are also accepted. Congratulations, SMS. This is a photo of the trophy that was given to our school because we were the top donating school to Heavenly Hats in the fall. We raised $864 to help cancer patients. Great job, SMS. Keep up your attendance so that you can attend the Spring Fling on March 29th. There are some great clubs that you can join if you do not have Spring Break plans. Be sure to check the Panther Press for more information. Kid Win Art Contest entries are due March 22nd. Today's Panther Spotlight is Trenton, Trenton Kornowski. Mr. Stell nominated him because Trenton enters class with a smile and a polite word or phrase every day. Let's see what the cafeteria will be serving for lunch today. Friday, let's hear it from the famous Mrs. Rice. Okay. Courtney Rice. And what do you teach? I teach theater. And what's the best part about teaching at SMS? The students and the faculty. Okay, what do you enjoy doing for fun? Uh, playing with my dog, shopping, and theater. Okay, tell us something interesting about yourself. I toured professionally doing like Broadway shows for seven years. Um, yeah. March 2nd is the official day of Read Across America, which celebrates the love of reading and Dr. Seuss's birthday. Do you remember celebrating Read Across America in elementary school? 
Welcome to March 2nd on the National Day calendar. On National Read Across America Day, we celebrate literacy and the authors who make it fun. Theodore Giesel was born on this day in 1904. He wrote and illustrated more than 60 books under the pen name Dr. Seuss. During World War II, he even went to war using political cartoons that denounced the tyrants of the day. But he is best loved for his mark on children's literature, and today we honor him with a poem of our own. From the biggest of big to the smallest of small, books open worlds to every and all. With stories of zazzles and hooplas and rats, dragons and castles and ponies and cats, pages of what-its who dance with their snoodles and swim with their frogs and dizzles and poodles. Whatever you want, just read something today to celebrate National Dr. Seuss Day. I'm Marlo Anderson with the National Day Calendar. See you again tomorrow as we celebrate every day. And that's the Panther Report for today. Please recite the school essentials with me. Today we will walk the Panther way. We will show kindness, earn respect, take responsibility, be of service, and work as a team.